the Women's Leaders Network constitutes a very significant platform to accelerate progress and it holds great promise because of the membership which is all women of high achievement. I hope that we can just be authentic. We need to create an environment where women feel safe. Women are the majority of NHS staff. Women all too often know that they could probably do it but don't like to put themselves forward and I think it's just having those honest conversations about how we can progress their careers that will really help people to develop themselves and realise that they have got that potential. I think there's also a great camaraderie that women share when they come together. So having a women's network is particularly useful. I think one of the things we have to do is encourage more women to go for more senior roles almost before they feel ready. At an organisational level, I think organisations themselves can do a lot to look at their numbers on their boards and put in HR processes that allow women to succeed. So HSJ Women Leaders is all about celebrating female senior leadership talent and encouraging it. What I hope the Women's Leaders Network can do is help the NHS encourage more women into senior leadership positions in a range of different ways. A lot of people ask me about what's the best way to advance women in the NHS. It needs every person in every NHS job to champion the cause thinking what can we each individually do and who can we go out and find to mentor and to create opportunities for. To feel confident enough in their workplace and in their professional lives and working lives to actually aspire and reach that glass ceiling and get beyond.